Baby, baby, look. I saw the look in this girl's eyes. There's no way we're gonna keep her away from that boy, so we have to take control of this situation. You're right. I gotta kill him. No. <laughs> and you can't kill them all. Yeah, but I can make an example out of this one, and then the word will start to get around. Baby, do you remember when we first started dating how my parents were so against it? Yeah, well, you were their baby girl. Yes, trying to... yes. My parents' overprotectiveness forced us to sneak around behind their backs. And because we didn't have the proper guidance, we ended up with Junior. I thought it was because we didn't have a condom. <laughs> Jay. Jay, what are you saying? I can't be a concerned father? No, I'm saying you're going to have to accept the reality that she really, really likes this boy. And there's nothing you can say or do to change that. I mean, keeping them apart, Michael, is going to make him even more attractive to her. Attractive? I don't know what she finds so attractive about this kid anyway. He's tall and skinny, got a bald head and pointy ears. I mean, what does she find so cute about him? I have no idea. But, baby, don't you think it'd be easier if we just accept it? No, it'd be easier just to bury him underneath the house. Listen. I need for you to become friends with this boy so that we can guide him and keep an eye on him. Hmm. You mean like in The Godfather? Keep your friends close and your enemies closer? Yes. When he messes up, he'll sleep with the fishes. <laughs>